identify the mark structure so if you see this particular figure this is your lungs and if you see you will be able to understand that this particular is the fissure and that is dividing the lungs into two lobes one is your upper lobe and second is your lower lobe now as we know that the lungs are going to be right lung and the left lung the right lung generally uh, the right lung is going to have three lobes right there are three lobes in the right lung and in the left lung you have two lobes so you can identify that this is the left lung here okay this is going to be the left lung now uh, we have to discuss about the hilum here because they have pointed out here on the hilum and we have to know the various structures in the hilum right so if i just discuss about the hilum yes there will be something called as bronchus and this bronchus you have to remember that it is the most posterior it is going to be the most posterior structure right then we have the second thing that is going to be called as the pulmonary veins now we have the pulmonary veins and these pulmonary veins are going to be the most anterior structure right so basically there are four pulmonary veins two superior and two inferior there are four two superior pulmonary veins and two inferior pulmonary veins right and then we have the third structure that is known as the artery so you are going to have the pulmonary artery as well so there is going to be pulmonary artery that will be also be present in the hilum and the pulmonary artery is the artery or the structure that is present between the pulmonary vein and bronchus right so it is going to be present between the pulmonary vein and bronchus so i'll just uh, try to make it more simple bronchus will be most superiorly situated then we have your pulmonary artery the pulmonary artery and finally most inferiorly we are going to have your pulmonary veins okay so these are the things which you have to remember uh, to get a good idea of this i'll make it more clear as well so uh, uh, i'll just divide the uh, discussion between two that is the right lung and the left lung so if i just write here the structures in the right lung okay and here the structure in the left lung okay so a uh, right lung is going to have first of all there will be a bronchus kind of thing okay and that is called as the ep arterial bronchus so there is going to be the ep arterial bronchus after the bronchus you are going to have the artery and that is called as the pulmonary artery that is called as the pulmonary artery then we have again the bronchus then again we have the bronchus here in the right lung and then we have pulmonary vein superior as well as inferior so there will be pulmonary vein somewhere here and that is going to be the superior pulmonary vein and this is going to be the inferior pulmonary vein so this is this is the sequence which you have to remember about the right lungs now there is slight difference in the left lung as well so uh, most superior you are going to have the pulmonary artery in this case pulmonary artery in this particular case will be the superior most and then just below this you are going to have your bronchus then you have your bronchus and then you have your superior and inferior uh, pulmonary vein so superior and superior and inferior pulmonary vein will be there so these are the structures that will be seen in the hilum so this is the actual illustration as well so here this particular part is going to be your anterior part this is going to be the posterior part okay if you just see this particular thing right so now here you will be seeing that the left pulmonary artery is going to be at the uppermost part and this is of course going to be the left lung here left lung okay then you have the superior pulmonary artery and inferior pulmonary artery this is the superior and this one is the inferior one and here you will be seeing the bronchial arteries as well 
and this particular thing is going to be your bronchus okay so these are the structures so same way you will have the pulmonary artery at the top then bronchus and then there will be superior and inferior pulmonary artery so this we have to just understand with the help of the figure or you just remember this sequence uh, your uh, you can easily do all the questions here so yes uh, there is one uh, mnemonic to solve this particular question as well so if we go from the superior to inferior you will have the mnemonic that is known as atal bihari vajpai atal bihari vajpai now this basically is going to give you the correct uh, uh, sequence from superior to inferior of these structures so first you have the pulmonary artery a here stands for the artery then you have your bronchus b stands for the bronchus and v stands for the pulmonary vein that is going to be v right vein so this is the actual sequence so now coming back to the question here uh, if we see the identify the mark structure and this is the mark structure here right so if you see you have most superiorly something and superior is going to be your atal that is your artery that is pulmonary artery then in middle you are going to have your bihari that is bronchus and lower most is going to be your vein that is inferior vein in this case so that is uh, pulmonary vein right so if you see this particular structure this is in the middle and that is going to be your bronchus in the case of left lung so it is basically your primary since the lung is left here so that is going to be left bronchus so answer to this question is going to be option second that is primary left bronchus